guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be doing a declutter of this vanity so if you guys are new here thank you for clicking on this video please subscribe to be a part of the mermaid squad and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for joining me today so if you guys remember when i organized this bad boy and i said that i'm gonna have to go through it and go through all the things that are expired i just didn't have time for it so i put all of my single eyeshadows back here i don't really use these as much but i'm a hoarder and keep everything so one day i might just go through everything but right now i'm just gonna keep it all well today's the day so i decided to declutter all of this stuff i'm kind of happy because i feel like all this stuff on my dresser um sorry my vanity is too much i actually want to downsize because i feel like it's too big but i'm just gonna leave it for now but yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today, and this is probably going to take me a while, so you guys really seem to love decluttering videos, and this is probably one of the most requested videos, and it was one video that I've been, you know, putting on the back burner, but today's the day. <laughs> so if you do like videos like this, give it a thumbs up, and let's go on this journey of decluttering all this expired makeup that is in here. So, um... I'm gonna have a hard time, I'm gonna be honest, because there's some that I am emotionally attached to and there's some that I will use during like Halloween. So I have to really figure out what I wanna keep. And if you see like the camera moving like it is right now, it's because I just got a little baby kitten. Um, he is eight weeks and his name is Benji. I do have a new kitten vlog on my channel, so definitely check that out if you want to meet him and see the journey of me getting him and stuff but today he's yeah all over the place playing with toys and stuff because you know he's a little kid but yeah let's get started so I think the first drawer I'm gonna do actually I'm not gonna go in order I definitely want to do these lipsticks because I know exactly what I want to get rid of like all of these all of these MAC lipsticks gotta go these are from like 2012 I think these are very very old so let me actually get um like a little bag so i can start throwing things away yeah let's get started <laughs> i know for a fact that he's gonna play with this bag so <laughs> you're probably gonna hear it but yeah i'm gonna get rid of all of these i love them but i don't really support mac anymore because they are not cruelty free and um they're just old as hell so i'm not gonna keep like look at this one this one is so crusty dusty i'm not keeping that so, um, and some things I'm gonna keep for my kit um, because I do do freelance makeup. So yeah, all of these ColourPop lipsticks, gotta go, honey. Ew, look at this one. It's like all separated. Disgusting. Garbage. All right, so I'm gonna do this. Um, I'm gonna talk a little bit, but, oh, you guys can't even see what the hell I'm doing. Of course, let me like move the camera, duh. All right, this is totally better. And I have my green smoothie that I'm gonna be drinking because I'm starving. So yeah, like I said, I'm gonna be talking, but this is mostly like me getting rid of my stuff. So I know like, like do these expire? Lip pencils? Ugh, they smell really bad. So you know what? Let's just chuck them. And I could back to Mac some of this stuff, but I don't even really shop at Mac anymore. So I'm just gonna Maybe I'll keep them to the side, and if my sister wants to go to MAC and get something, she can. So actually, let me do that. This lip gloss is pretty new, so I'm gonna keep that. Dude, this, this gloss is so old. Do I smell it? Wow, it actually smells really good. I'm very surprised because I think this is from like 2011, maybe? I really like this color though. I don't know if it's old or not, but it's Bobbi Brown. Um, they are also not cruelty free, but so here's the thing. I am cruelty free, but I'm not gonna get rid of stuff that I already bought, you know? Um, and I realized that when I said I was gonna stop using everything. So there's still things that I do use, but I'm not gonna repurchase. Um, I don't know, this is a maybe, it, it smells pretty good. So we're gonna keep that in the maybe pile and then we'll just keep the keep stuff over there this is by nars it's when i used to a freelance for them i don't really wear red lipstick anymore so i'm gonna give this away to somebody so that's gonna be in like a giveaway pile just because my hair is red now so yeah 
This is hard, man. I knew this video was gonna be hard. This is why I didn't wanna do it. Definitely not a fan of this. This lip color is really pretty. This is pretty for fall, so I might keep that one. Um, I'm not really a pink girl, and this this is like a pinky mauve. This is Back Talk by Urban. Nah, we're gonna, I guess we'll donate and then whoever doesn't really want it. I mean, I use my, I use it though. It's kind of weird. This is pretty too, but with my hair, it's not gonna, it's not gonna go. So we're just gonna throw all these away. It's kind of sad because these are definitely not expired, but I gotta declutter, you know? I gotta get rid of it. So, uh, just gonna throw it away. <laughs> um, again, I might keep these little guys because for a Halloween, like I said. So these are just mini red lipsticks. So I think I'm gonna keep those. I don't think I'm gonna talk anymore because I have a lot of drawers to go through. Oh my God, wait a minute. Can we just talk about this? Can we talk about how disgusting this is? Ew, it's like, ugh. no, that's garbage. I need to throw that away right now. This is garbage too. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm not gonna be talking because I have a lot of drawers and it's just gonna take me forever. So just, just watch me declutter. <laughs> All right, so moving on to this drawer. This is bronzers, blush, and highlights. I hate how my chair doesn't have wheels anymore because I put it in my computer room. But yeah, there's way too many blushes in here and I literally only use one. There's way too much stuff in here and like these body glitters, like they're just in the way. I can never fully open it. So like, look at this highlighter. Like, where am I going with this? But again, like this is good for Halloween. So I don't know, I'm gonna have to figure it out. But yeah, so this drawer, look at it. There's like nothing in here now. So I just have a couple of lipsticks, two dark, couple nude, but yeah. And then, uh, then some MAC ones that I really do like, but like I said, I'm not gonna purchase MAC anymore or NARS because they're not cruelty free. But yeah, this looks so much better. And now I can fit more stuff underneath here, which is good. But yeah, this looks perfect. And then I have all of my um, like liners, my colored liners here, and then I have all of my neutral liners here. The rest are in my makeup bag, as you saw. So yeah, let's move on to, to this craziness. Love this highlighter so much. I know it looks crusty, but this is like one of my favorite liquid highlighters, so I'm not getting rid of this. <laughs> but yeah, let's go through this guy right now. So this drawer is done. So what I did is I decided to keep like one blush cause I had a lot of blushes that were the same color. So yeah, these are just highlighters by Becca. This is a cream and then this is a powder. So I really like cream highlighters. So I just kept that one, the Marc Jacobs. I kept that one, I kept the Marc Jacobs one and I kept this Becca one, um, and this is in Champagne Pop. I know this is probably expired, but I usually use this for the body. So just gonna slide that back under here. And then for highlighters, like I said, I'm gonna be doing some Halloween looks um, come October, so I don't wanna throw away too much, but I ba basically kept all of the Becca highlighters because I love them so much. So I have mostly all of them since I did used to work for Becca. Yeah, and then I have this like iridescent pink one. I think this would be pretty for um, Halloween. And then I have another, see, I don't wanna keep two of them. So this is where I see, I know that the better quality one is definitely the Becca one. 
So let's just compare. And it's a little bit lighter too. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get rid of this one and just keep the Becca one. This one has some purple iridescent to it, but I'm gonna keep the pink one by Becca. Um, these are really pretty um, gold highlighters. So I have this one that looks crusty dusty, but you know, whatever. And then this is my favorite highlighter. This is from like a Christmas collection forever ago. And I just love how it goes on. So I'm just gonna keep that in the blush for Halloween until I run out of it. Um, another Becca highlighter. So yeah, and then I just put my, oh, right here. And then I just put my favorites in the front. This is an old Becca um, Chloe and Malika palette. I love the highlighter, as you can see, not too fond of the blushes or the bronzer, but the highlighter is bomb. And then I have my bronzer. I have this really pretty gold highlighter that um, Becca came out with that was limited edition. My favorite highlighter, which is Topaz. I wear this every day. I have it on right now. I don't know if you can see. And then my favorite blushes. So yeah, this looks so much better compared to what it looked like before. Holy crap. Like my drawers just look so much better and now I can fit more stuff and I can probably even like condense some things, but we're gonna figure that out afterwards. So this drawer, mostly everything's gonna go because like some of this stuff, like look, it's separating, it's disgusting. This is where all my foundations, concealers, powders are. And look, I have all of these freaking primers from when I worked at Becca. I love this primer. It's so nice and hydrating and it gives you a really nice glow. So I need to figure out um, what I'm gonna do with all these because there's just too many. I can't keep all these. <laughs> but yeah, these definitely gotta go. I love them. They're discontinued now, but yeah. The fact that they're separating and nasty, no. Gotta go. Old beauty blenders, don't know why I'm keeping that. I hate this beauty blender so much. Oh, I actually keep this for Halloween makeup, so I'm gonna keep that, just kidding. Um, but yeah, this is, I don't know if you guys love the Morphe sponge. I'm not a huge fan. It's so freaking hard, I can't stand it. But this is really good for Halloween makeup, so I'm gonna keep that. But yeah, let's um, go through this drawer now because I love this primer and it's always under here and I always have to move this to reach it, so. Let's do that. So the third drawer is done. Um, I put all of my foundations that I'm currently loving right here. It used to be up here in this, um, oh, let me move you up so you can see. It used to be in this drawer, but I'm trying to transition this to something else because there's just, like I said, too much stuff on this table. So I put my foundation here, uh, concealers here. I have this Clinique um, makeup remover. Did not buy this because it's not cruelty free, but you know, gotta use it. Um, ben Nye powder that I love. Also love the Urban powder, but as you saw, it doesn't fit. So I just keep it down here. Um, primers. I have my contour stick by uh, Juvia's Place. And I have my corrector, another concealer by LA Girl. And my favorite powder in the world. If you guys know, you know I love this powder so much. It's waterproof by Urban, so bomb. Um, yeah. So that's the top part. The bottom is just like extra stuff, um, extra powders that I have that I might need when I do makeup um, for Halloween and stuff. If I don't wanna use like my good stuff, you know what I mean? So yeah, just some random stuff in here. And then I put all of those Becca primers back here because I really like this and they're not open. So I'm gonna keep them. So if I ever run out in my kit or I need it or something, I can just go right there. And yeah, so now I have a spot for my primers because I would always have to like move stuff out of the way. Now I could just open this drawer. Everything is laid out for me. So yeah, I'm excited about this. 
All right, this drawer is where all my palettes are. This I know is gonna be hard for me because I have some palettes here that, do I still have them? Oh my God, did I get rid of them? Wow, I got rid of them. Never mind. I had palettes here that I've had for a long time, but I got rid of them. Um, but this, <laughs> I've showed you guys this before. This is the first palette that I ever bought. I think I got this at like the dollar store or something. Look at it. Dude, that's crazy. And the colors are so vibrant. Like I was really shook. Look at that pigment. Okay, dollar store. So yeah, I mean, there's no matte shades in here, but I was rocking this. I'm gonna keep this forever. Like, look at that. That's insane, the, the pigment. So yeah, we're gonna keep this forever. I don't care. Um, I thought I said a name on it or something, but yeah, I don't care if it's expired or whatever. This is memory, it's gonna keep this forever. Gonna show my kids like, look, look what mommy has. <laughs> Dead. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go through this. Um, I kind of got rid of some palettes, but honestly, some palettes I don't even use anymore, but they're gonna be good for Halloween, but I just have too many. Like this one, I don't even use. This is by Becca. Um, I, when this palette came out, I was like, are you serious? Because there's no darker shade for, you know, transition for darker girls. But I love the colors, but you know, I just, it's just not it, like, uh, you know? So it's it's gotta go, yeah. All right, let me, let me get started with this. Look, I just got this freaking palette. I don't even use it. What the hell? But this is really good for um, Halloween, so I'm gonna keep this. But I really did like this palette, but I don't know, I'm not feeling these colors right now. I do love the yellow. Okay, let me stop talking so I can get, get this done. <laughs> Okay, so that was easy. <laughs> I literally got rid of like three palettes. Um, I don't know, man. I like all of these palettes. I can use them for different looks for Halloween because they're all different colors. So I'm just gonna keep them. Hi, Benji. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep all of them for now. Move the stuff, I guess, I don't know. But th this is just taking up so much space. Like, I'm trying to see. Maybe I can like, I don't know, man. Cause this, it's just too much. Like maybe my mini palettes, I can move in here. Maybe I'll just lay them out like that. Yeah, there we go. And then this one put it here too okay so if I ever need like mini palettes at least I can like see them all right um these have to be somewhere too maybe I'll put them in the back since I don't use them as much as I thought I was going to I'll put this one in the far back with this I don't even know why I'm keeping this stupid thing like I don't even use these at all what is this? I know this is a highlighter. This is Kitten by Stila. This is, oh my God, this is so old. Ew, dude, I don't even know if I wanna keep that. We're just, we're just gonna chuck this. I don't even need a Z palette anymore because I don't really buy loose shadow, like whatever. I'm just gonna chuck it. All right, now we're gonna make room for this. And of course I'm gonna put them in colored water. And then let's go through the hair stuff because I have a bunch of shit in here that I don't even need. Like all these freaking scrunchies. I can't even use a scrunchie in my hair. Um, when I had faux locks, like I can't even, I can put in my hair now, but it's like weird, you know? I don't know, maybe I'll keep them. I got some weave in here. I think I'm gonna just throw this away because I don't even wear weave anymore. I'll just buy a new one if I want to combs in here that I don't even freaking use. Let's go through all of this. Like, I don't even use this diffuser. So we're just gonna chuck it. I don't even really use a blow dryer. The only time I do is for when I get my hair cut and my hair done. Yeah, and I have this like crappy blow dryer that I use. So I'm just gonna keep it for that purpose. 
but I kind of want to move it because it just takes up so much space. Um, let me show you guys what else I have in this drawer. Let's get lower actually. All right, so um, this paddle brush I'm gonna keep because that goes with the blow dryer. I have my scarves in here, which I love. Okay, let me figure this out because I'm just gonna keep going back and forth. So yeah, this is the last drawer on this side. Then we have to do this side and then we're done. So let's work on this guy right now. All right, so that was pretty easy. Um, move this down more so you can see. Look at this bag, it's like so heavy, oh my God. Um, okay, so I have my, all my scarves here. I put the scrunchies here because I can probably use them for Halloween, so I'm just gonna keep them for now. These are shirts that I use for my hair. As you can see, they're all like crazy and gross. Um, just because the towel makes it more frizzy, so I just use those. I put the blow dryer in here because I have nowhere else to put it, so I'm just gonna keep it there for now. I kept all the combs, paddle brush, and then these are for my faux locks. So I'm gonna keep those because I can use it in my hair now, but you know, I don't, but <laughs> just in case I wanted to. So yeah, this drawer is done. It looks a lot better. Um, definitely can be organized a little bit better, but it looks better for now. All right, so let's move on to the other side. All right, so this is where, oh, I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with these um, straighteners. I wish like you guys were here so I can just like give them to you. This is a really good straightener. Um, I know it looks disgusting, but it's so bomb, but I just don't straighten my hair ever. So yeah, gotta give those away to somebody. Um, so these are all of my eyeshadows and my lashes. Whoo boy. So I literally put this here because it's the only eyeshadow I use <laughs> um, that's loose anyway. All these glitters I'm gonna keep for Halloween looks, but like all this eyeshadow, I don't know, this is this drawer is hard. This is why I kind of didn't start here because I never know what I wanna make for Halloween. And like, if I do, I mean, I probably have a palette, but I just wanna keep them. All right, I, I'm just gonna get rid of what I know I can get rid of. Cause like this is like years old, even though it's so, so pretty. This is so old, I know for a fact. But look how beautiful it is. But like, oh my God, it's so pretty. Damn it. I don't know. This is like a pressed eyeshadow. Do they smell? It doesn't, it doesn't smell like anything. Oh my God. Remember I used to use this for my eyebrows because of my hair. So why is this so hard? I might, let's come back to this. I'm not ready yet. And then I have some like lashes and these lashes are all mink, which is bad. But like some of these are crusty dusty, so I'm gonna get rid of them. But yeah, no longer buying mink lashes because I think it hurts the animal. So we're just gonna use, um, I'll show you my favorite one. My favorite are these, Ilora, they are cruelty free. I looked it up. And yeah, I really like these and they're cute. So all of these other lashes I can just use for clients since I'm not gonna be using them or if I wanna do like looks until they are unusable. So I know these are crusty dusty, I'm just gonna throw those away. Okay, so let's, let's work on eyeliners. Okay. These are crusty. I know that for a fact. I've had these forever. Like you can probably even see how, yeah, these are crusty. All right, let's go. Oh my God, ew, look, it's like dry and moving. Oh, okay, no. Um, yeah, let's go through this drawer. I didn't do too much. I just kind of did a little bit of rearranging because I kind of like how it was. I put all of my neutral pencils here, the ones that I kind of like gravitate towards. And then I put the darker, like purpley, um, black is in there. 
blue. I put those here. Then I have my mascaras. I think I'm actually gonna switch it because I like my mascaras. No, I actually like my mascaras here. And then I have all of my glitters, which I love by Urban. I love these glitters so much. Then we have just more liners. I just separated them by color. Like these are more vibrant colors. Uh, that's just a brow pencil I have randomly there. Um, and then I have this white NYX pencil, love this. And then I just have other pencils here that are just different colors. So yeah, I didn't really change it up too much. And then these are for Halloween. I just like these, like they honestly suck, but they're really good as a base. So I don't like waste too much makeup. So I just kept them here. Um, I have my beauty blender uh, cleaner right here. Love that so much. And then all my extra stuff is here. So if I ever need it, I can just grab it. That's that. So let's move on to this junk drawer. So I have some giveaway stuff in here, so I don't want you guys to see, but I have like vitamins in here. Oh my God, like my gauges I have in here. I have so much random ish in here. Um, yeah, let me just clean this up because this looks crazy. And then we, we can move on to the hair one. Yeah, all this stuff is just so random. Like someone gave this to me when I worked at Ulta and there's no way in hell I'm gonna use them because look at this freaking ingredients list. Are you gonna focus? Yeah. This is all the ingredients. So absolutely not. I'm going to give this away. I like to give stuff away to people too when they come here. So I like to just keep this stuff here. But yeah, let's go through um, the other drawer. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> let's go through, oh. I want to show you. We're going to go through the third drawer now. That's good. So it just started pouring. So if you hear thunder, that's nature. <laughs> so for this drawer, it's still like a junk drawer, I guess. I don't know. Um, I have my contacts here, my gauges, you know, tools here. I put all of my um, Q-tips here just so they're easy to grab. Um, and then I have my nail stuff here, which I don't really do my nails too much, but you know, quarantine happens. So I just got some nail stuff. So I just put that there. And then underneath I have my fan. So this fan is for makeup, but I actually like to use it for the beach and stuff if I'm really hot. So I keep that there extra contacts. This bag is for, I learned this trick from Jenny69, if you follow her. So she puts this bag over her face and when she puts a, um, a shirt on, the makeup doesn't get on it. So as you can see, I have makeup all over it. So I just keep this here since I don't really like to buy plastic bags. So I just use that for that. So yeah, um, I have brush cleaner, extra vitamins, um, nail polish remover, and then my glasses cleaner. So I just put that there. Everything else I moved that was in here, it was like setting spray and stuff. I'm gonna move it to the bottom because it just doesn't need to be here. So now this is nice and organized, I guess. Like, I don't know, this will just have to be that drawer. Um, all right, so for this drawer, I have my, I took the, the thing that was in here, but I have my Q-Redu, I have some extra water bottles. Like I said, I just refill these um, because I don't, like to put tap water in here. So I just like to make it more convenient. I keep these water bottles usually. Um, and then I just have extra um, hair stuff that I don't really use that I think I'm just keeping for Travis. I have no idea. But um, I'm gonna add some more hair stuff um, that's up here. Cause this just looks too much. So I completely got rid of all of this stuff. Hey, <laughs> I completely got rid of all of this stuff. So I think I'm gonna use this for my actual desk. Um, my computer desk so I can put some stuff in here in here because I just don't need it like it's just it's way too much stuff on this desk and it's just it gets too cluttered so now I'm gonna move some of this stuff in this drawer so I have more room so that's what I'm gonna do now <laughs> All right, this drawer was pretty easy. So I just put all the stuff like I showed you up there in here. So I have castor oil. I've been loving this again. So this is a curl enhancing mousse by Design Essentials. Love this so much. So I'm gonna keep that in here. And I use this sometimes if my hair needs to get more curls. So yeah, I use this sometimes. So I'm just gonna stick it in here as well. Then I have my Eco Styler. I've been using that again recently. My Curlsmith. Um, hello. <laughs> 
This is the Curl um, Defining Styling Souffle. And then I have my favorite mask right now, which I shared in my one of my vlogs, I think. Um, oh, the actually, I shared this in my kitten vlog, yes. So this is the Maui Moisture Hair Care. I, I got another um, bottle of this because I ran out of the other one, but it smells so good. Oh my God, love this one so much. So yeah, and then I have my um, Easy Detangler back there with my Curadu and my water bottle. So this is gonna be in my hair drawer, which is great. Um, I have to figure out where I wanna put my other combs and stuff, but I'm gonna show you guys the top once I am done with the drawers so I can organize that. But yeah, we're almost done. We have this last drawer right here, which is full of, full of a bunch of shit. Um, I like to keep this rug here because I have an extension cord and I like to cover it, but right now we're gonna have to push it back. Yeah, this is ridiculous. I have so much skincare, so I'm gonna have to figure this drawer out. I organized this too and it just became this huge mess again. So I don't, I don't know what I wanna do. Oh my God, I've talked about this mask before. This is bomb. And I do this mask with the apple cider vinegar and I add turmeric to it. I put my sister on it, she loves it. Definitely try it out. And this is on Amazon, it's really inexpensive. But yeah, let's um let's figure this shit out. This is like ridiculous, man. I'm really happy with all the other drawers though. Oh my god, and we still have to go through this one. I forgot. All right, so this is the best that I can do for now for this drawer. Um, eventually I want to get rid of these little packets. Like I said, when people come over, I like to give them stuff, but no one has been over here. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna keep it like this for now. And then I have a bunch of stuff on the desk I have to deal with. All that stuff is organized for the most part. So let's get into this. I might just leave this like it is, honestly, because like I said, I'm not ready to get rid of some of this stuff. All right, some of this ColourPop stuff I can get rid of because I've had this for way too long. Yeah, let me, I'm gonna get rid of some of this ColourPop stuff because like, no, these are disgustingly old. This is when ColourPop first like came out. That's how old that is. And then I'm gonna throw all of these away. All of these like little Mac palettes, they gotta go. Okay, so look, I got rid of that, okay. And then I'm just gonna keep the rest of this. See, I'm a hoarder, man. What can I tell you? Some of these I can get rid of though. But like, see these vibrant colors I like to keep because I don't even know why, because I have like, I have this color already. <laughs> this is so hard, damn it. Ooh, she's crusty espresso. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of espresso. I guess I'll get rid of like the basic colors. I'm always gonna keep this. This is uh, from the Selena collection. So we're gonna keep her forever. This is from the Star Trek collection. Oh, so pretty. I feel like that didn't really wow me though. You know, that swatch was not it. But it's from a collection. I do have the lipsticks though, so let's get rid of her. Let's just do it. I still have this pink one in my hand. Um, that is pretty. No, we're gonna keep that one. Okay, listen, I'm making progress here. Is this saddle? Oh my God, you guys know how I feel about saddle. If you're like an OG subscriber, I used to use this thing all of the time. Okay, we're gonna keep her. <laughs> um, yeah, all the rest of them I'm gonna keep for Halloween purposes. I keep saying that because it just makes me feel better <laughs> that I'm keeping all of these stupid eyeshadows that I don't need. Um, and now I have all this extra space. So I guess I'll just do that, that's better. Okay, so I got rid of a lot, okay. But this drawer, these are all glitters, like I said, especially like these little hearts and stuff. I like to keep those for specific looks, so. We're done with the drawers, okay? We're done. <laughs> so let me show you guys the aftermath. Look at all this crap. This is ridiculous. So, wait, what is this doing here? Excuse me. So this is all that we're working with. Um, I have some giveaway stuff in here. I have some random other stuff in here. So I'm gonna move this because I know that this is gonna be for my desk. 
but i'm glad that this is clear because now i get to put like this huge ass jar of coconut oil i use for my body so now i get to put that there but i'm just gonna organize this now and stop talking um so we can close out this video so because i feel like it's gonna be really really long but yeah, I'm gonna just start organizing now. Oh my God, look how much better this looks. It looks cleaner. It looks so freaking good. So this is gonna go on my kit, so that's why I just have it here for now. Um, I have my, here, let me take you guys off so you can see. I have my body stuff here. This is freaking amazing. So this is when I got my uh, chakra kit. So this is, I don't know what the ingredients are in here, but it's just, it smells really good. Um, so I use this as a perfume. Love it. It's not that strong, but I still like it. Um, and then I have my dirty brushes here or the brushes that I use every day. I actually have to clean them. Then I have my deodorant in here, my body oil, and then all of this didn't really change. All of my brushes. I don't even need all these brushes, honestly, but we're just going to keep them for now. Um, and then I have this really, really nice smelling candle that I got from uh, TJ Maxx. It smells so freaking good. So I just keep this here along with some perfumes and then I have my mirror. So I just think this looks so much cleaner. I love it. I love all of my drawers. I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I definitely did. Um, I feel a little bit better. I honestly need to clean a lot more, but I think I did a pretty good job since I am such a makeup hoarder. I think that's the only thing I'm a hoarder of is makeup. But yeah, like I said, I think I did a good job, so. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it inspired you to clean out any old makeup that you have in your house, in your vanity. I have to show you guys this big ass bag of stuff that I have. Hopefully it doesn't rip. But this big old bag is full of expired makeup that I no longer need in my life. And that honestly makes me feel so much better. Just seeing all of that stuff, like, whew, I feel like a weight has been lifted off my shoulder as you guys see in my other um, decluttering videos. But yeah, that is it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, be a part of my mermaid squad, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. I'm not going to be able to do that.